what is up guys this is my first tutorial and today I will show you how to make or how to sync the camera from Sigma 4D to the trap code particular plugin in After Effects so the particles go like the camera is going you know what I mean here's an example <laughs> Okay, the first thing you need to do is right click on Sima 4D and go open file location. And here you can see the folder exchange plugins uh, and you go after effects, uh, windows and choose the ver version. If you use uh, CS6 or CC whatever just above cs5 just choose the cs5 right click copy and go to your adobe after effects uh, adobe after effects file location and just paste it into the plugins folder and if you're asking what is this c4 c4d importer This is the part you need to do in Sima 4D. When you finish your intro or, or whatever, you need to make a camera and make animation on camera, you know. And now, go to save. This is the render settings. If you're using a custom made Lightroom or whatever, you can probably find some custom re render settings. But, just click here, compositing compositing project file click check all of this and check uh, and choose after effects and that's all and render out your intro when did you render out your intro you will get this AAC file and now this is the part in after effects I will do now now when you are in after effects just load up or make particles normal trap code particles here's some particles i got so when you loaded up your particles right click import file not just file find the folder where did you render out your 3d text from cinema and just to choose this not this only this and click import and you will get this and uh, double click on this composition choose this now you get camera this is the camera synced I mean exported from Cinema 4D uh, I will edit uh, cut edit and paste I will paste it in this comp composition and now render it out you see the same camera from Cinema 4D so now your intros will be beautiful like you are <laughs> just kidding that's all of the things you need to do to make your to export camera from cinema 4d to after effects and now just choose the old render settings in the cinema you just need to check uh, those check marks and voila there you go and thanks for watching see you next time and don't forget to subscribe and like.